Welcome back. Today I have got you another top 10 side data tweaks which is compatible with iOS 13 to 13.3. And now if you take a look at the icon, you can see the icon on my home screen. It is a bit rotated. Move on to the next one. This is the tweak for control center. And now if you go to control center, you can see all of those buttons has been moved down a little bit. So this is the tweak that pulls down all of those buttons and you can quickly assess with one hand without having to reach um, to the top. And now you can quickly reach all of those buttons without using two hands. So you just um, use your left hand or the right hand so you can assess all of those buttons. It is much. And now if you take a look at the bottom on the page dot, you can see um, the page dot has been changed. In order to change this dot button, you need to install uh, one theme. So you can go back to settings and then go to snowboard. And this is the theme. You can select the theme and you need to install Dyna dots. And then you have a bunch of options that you can choose with um, different options. So now let's go to um, the board bars. Just in the ball is one. And then click on apply. Click on check button. And now you can go back. So you can see um, the peg dot has been changed. So in order to get this to work, make sure on Snowboard you need to install extension as well. And make sure you install peg dots extension. Otherwise it doesn't work. So it allows you to customize phone app and you can see by the title here, we have favorite tape, we have recent tape, so we can customize all of those. And we have the background and we have the contest bar and we have um, tape bar, um, navigation bar and blank. And let's leave it as default. So if you want the custom one, you can select the color, but I'm going to leave it as default and then we can respring. And now you can see on uh, my phone app, so we have the custom color and on contest, we also have the custom color as well. And on favorite, so we have um, the custom color as well. And now this is the brand new tweaks. It allows you to quickly search um, anything just by um, select on the text. So we have um, the custom mode as well. You can go to light mode or dark mode. Um, it is um, compatible with iOS 13. So now let's go to demonstration. So let's say I want to search something. So let's say hello. And then I can just select um, this text. And on the right side, you can see the search button. So click on it. And it will bring up the page and it allows you to search um, straight away. As you can see. And the good thing about it tweaks, I can just cancel Spotlight. And now I can go to, I can still see this page and I can close it. And I'll go back to setting. So you have other choice as well. So you can select um, different engine. So the first one that I saw you, um, we use Google. Or you can use Start Page or the other search engine. And for the browser, you can go to Chrome, Firefox or Opera. So let's go to Firefox. And now let's search again. Select on the text and then click on search button. And I will bring up uh, Firefox. You can see the logo on the top here. This is the tweak for Notification Center. And now let's go to Notification Center. And you can see my Notification Center has been changed to Android style. And we have all of those buttons on the top. And if you spy more, you can see more button here. So up on the top, just like the Android device. And now you can customize the notification center as well. You can go to Pixel or you can go to Audio. And then we can see the different style. So now you can see um, it has been changed. For the tweaks, I cannot show you on the screen. So this is the tweak that allows you to get um, haptic feedback whenever the respring has been done. So whenever your phone has been respring and you can feel haptic feedback, a, a little click on the hand. So you can install it by the title on the video. Let's go to latch key. This is the tweak that allows you to change um, the face ID icon. Now let's go to settings and you can customize the position. And then you can also select the theme, which is um, the custom face ID icon. And now let's go to series block and then you can select the custom color as well if you want. And then you can display. And you can see my custom Face ID icon on the left side. 
on the status bar. Notification bar allow you to set the notification, the most important notification for individual app. So you can see here, so we have most important apps. So you just select on the app that you think it is the most important and then it will show on the notification center. So for the most important, it, it will show first on the um, notification center so you don't miss it. Genesis allow you to customize um, almost all elements. So you can customize control center, you can customize icon layout, you can customize lock screen, you can customize power menu, you can customize springboard or you can customize status bar. And if you go to each one, so you have um, each button here, so you can customize round module. And then let's go to icon layout. So you can customize icon layout on the home screen. And on lock screen, you can customize the font. And you just enable this one, select the custom font. And we have alignment, so let's go to left. And we have um, date, so we have date option, we have font size. Let's go to times option. So we have 12 hours or 24 hours. So we can go to weather. And then we can customize power menu. So we have uh, more sliders and springboard. And we can hide some label, pick dots, or you can hide dark background as well. And on status bar, you can hide charging boy, or you can show percentage in battery. And now we can apply and hit on yes and you can see the clock has been moved to the left finally thanks for watching i hope you like all of these tweaks and then i will see you in the next one